sceneries and we're certainly looking forward to getting around this beautiful city. Kind of turning it on here so the fans around the city have come through tonight. And so we're all set for the run chase. 188 is what the home team are looking for to look to get their third win under their belt, third consecutive win. Uh, when you have a look at just what they could have been chasing, Dirk Nannis, uh, I think they'll be happy with this. I think they will be. Good pitch. A little bit of swing straight away. Cracked away. Four runs for the captain. Did so well in not bowling. Can't get away with that sort of length on this surface. It's too good a pitch. It's a good pitch. This is going to be tough work for the Zalmi. Yeah. Last ball of the over. And he finds the boundary. And, uh, they have the momentum after two wins in a row. Rath Ali now. Why oh, wouldn't it be with so much talent on show? March Madness, if you want some tickets. Well bowled. That's gone away for four. While that, under the challenges of bowling on a fast pitch, you bowl of absolute beauty. And before anyone can blink, it's gone to the boundary. Could have gone anywhere. Oh boy, now they can get the single. Got to about 200. Now they've got to watch out that they don't give away unnecessary runs. Zaman wanted a single, probably rightfully so. 22 without loss. Oh, that is huge. Six runs. Changed ends. Look, Zaman's having none of it. Lovely strike. He goes again, and this time it's even bigger into the crowd. With a man who's opening himself up to play this sort of shot, that's exactly the ball you're looking for. Eighty-one meters. Highest score is thirty-three against Islamabad United. Is this the night for Fakhar Zaman? Or is seen Ben Dunk? There's still Chris Lynn to come. You're putting, you're taking the pressure off this middle order and have a look at it. Chris Lynn, Hafiz and Dunk. Awesome. Fantastic bright side. Fan of the match, face painting. I mean, so much colour in, in the fans throughout this tournament. Hassan Ali. Oh, there we go. There's an opportunity. Opportunity, Brathwaite. Oh, the big fella. He's got the biggest hands out there. Can be difficult to line the ball up, floodlights, etc. But he had an age to get himself in position. Never got in the right one. Sahal survives. Well, oh, the cost of dropping them. Dunk was dropped on 11 and went on to score 99 so always no butch is a batsman if you get this sort of let off you think well i've got to make them pay because that is unusual to see him drop one the psl shuru hua ke cash karenge inshallah gareeb log the allah ne meri suni yahan par aaya hu aur khuda ka nihaat shukr ada karta hu doston ne sab ne kaha aap kya zarur karenge abhi main ground mein baitha hua tha to mere doston ke phone aa rahe the Walda bhi keh rahi thi inshallah catch aayegi aur achanak ekdam se catch hai aur man playing mixed martial arts and they won several medals both of them by the way are siblings um bhai bhai dono yahan pe hain aur dono hi jo hai mma ke yeah it's a bit of indecision really they both gone they probably would have made it but uh, so alaktar is going to end up a long way short it was a good bit of work behind the stumps from cam and akmal there's a calmness about what he's doing at the moment <laughs> goes bang down the ground so it's hit the end of the viewfinder wrong and from uh, yes his shot 
didn't turn, didn't grip. And Faka just smoked it down the ground. We don't want to see any cameraman get hit. Oh, gee, he moves quickly too. Oh, I hope you're all right. There's one bounce and oh, keep that down. We're in control and that's what he can do, see? Chris Lynn, the first time he has a crack. Murderous strength from Chris Lynn. Of somebody like Chris Lynn, this is hitting the top half of the bat and going nowhere. He has got through that so, so quickly. Absolutely destroyed it over mid-wicket. My word. The Kalanders and the games that they've won chasing here. Two games, one against uh, the Gladiators and one against the Kings the other night. At the halfway point, they looked as though they were way, way short. The Pepsi catch a craw. So, you know, share one craw, and it's been fumbled, fumble. Another go, come on. We want it clean. Oh, gee, they're fighting for it. Yeah, there it is. There he goes, hard, low, flat. Just to be running in and bowling the white ball at Chris Lynn. Goes for the Yorker, misses it and then gets whiplash as he watches it disappear back over his head. Yeah, no risk when you've got the vertical bat straight down the ground. Out of here! There it is again! Wonderful. Such a valuable contribution. The fans always. In the standings list, if they win today, white ball is played away quite nicely. There's a lot of craft in ball in that occasion. Oh, ball. <laughs> and no control over that whatsoever. Entertaining cricket. That's even better. <laughs> a bit of fun and giggle. Aleem Dartu face. <laughs> he got the scare of his life. He didn't know what to do with it. The initial. Right. Tapalti moment. For a, a bumpy ride from here. Here he goes. That's up in the air. Is it safe? Is it six? It is! But the intention, you cannot fault. Cross seamer. He's setting up as though he wants to baseball it out of the ground. That's probably not the ball you want to bowl. If I see a batsman setting up like this, I'm probably bowling full and wide. Something out of his... Once again, wrong length. He's doing that tonight. Again, that ball in that hitting zone. Skipper needs to get to him and say, let's get away from that ball. Let's ball something else. And square leg. Three fours, three sixes. Strike rate of almost 150, 35 balls innings. And he's not finished here. With and gone. Once again, Fokker has been fed with some easy stuff. Yeah, you're spot on, Ramiz. Once again, if you imagine a person set in that stance, where do you want it as a batsman? You want it in that hitting zone, exactly. Spin is pretty decent. We got the answer straight away. Sorry, mate, for asking it. The Lahore fans in full flow, back in Kalandas. HBL PSL, this time goes a little wide and still gets worked for four. So regardless of what he's like against spin, he can almost play this as a medium pacer. Ball's not necessarily turning. I've well, just been told that his strike rate, rate against spin is much better. <laughs> yeah, the placement is outstanding. Glorious placement. I don't mind what he's trying to do, get out of the hitting zone. But look at the way Chris Lynn there steps across to off. So that ball wasn't far enough away from him. It just shows what a challenge it is. Perfect. That's his 50. Wonderful innings. 
Relief for Kalandas, relief for Chris Lynn because they need Chris Lynn to be firing away as the playoffs situation. It's Chris Lynn and Parker Zaman currently at it and uh, they're doing it in some style. Half volley it is. Lonely before, but man, he's hit that hard. Crunch that away. Hoping that none of them get in the way. It's just vicious. Slashed back with a point. No chance whatsoever the fielders. No chance for the ball boy. It was another 70 metres behind them. Couple more overs. Will the home team do it? It's high in the air. There's a fielder running towards it. Under the lights. What a catch. And we might have even got a dive for the cameras in there as well. This went miles up in the air. But just watch Yashishar on the bottom of your screen. Sprinting in. Oh, he dives. He just makes it inside the 30-yard circle. Magnificent. Pulls off the jaunty dive. Have a look. Look. Wow. Out. Hard into a length. Just outside off stump, it's a swipe from Vaca. And guess what? Is Yasser Shah in the right place at the right time? Well, everything you do turns to gold. Miss cues, miss the fielders, fly for four. It's in the air and it will be caught. Will this be caught? Yes, it will. Oh, almost fumbled. Tom Banton. And finally, somebody has burst Ben Dunn's bubble. Whoops, almost, almost spilt it. Oh, four runs, exactly what the home team needed.